first thing you want to start with is start with the end in mind. You want to think about what you actually want the students to learn. Now, this might sound like a really obvious thing, but a lot of people miss it or go in with a good intention of intending to think about the thing they want the teachers, the students to learn. And actually, they end up thinking about, well, I'd really like them to come away with a great looking poster for the display, which is nothing wrong with that, except that the goal of the lesson is to improve their knowledge, is to move them forward a little, is to is to, you know, advance their learning. And the outcome shouldn't be the product of their writing or the product of their drawing or their product of whatever it is they're going to make. It should be the thing they're going to learn. And we call that the learning objective. Sometimes shortened to LO. Um, other various schools use all different kind of acronyms and things. So, um, but I call it the learning objective. Lots of people call it the learning objective. So the first thing you need to do is decide on your learning objective. What are they going to get from the lesson? What are they going to learn? Then the activity comes on the back of that. So you need to think about the activity that you will create for them to help them learn the learning objective. 